Hi, my name is Sean Beasley with OTRS and I just wanted to show you a tool called the Support Assessment Tool that's available to the public. If you go to the Admin section and then click on Package Manager, once you've got to Package Manager you'll see a list of online repositories. If you don't see this list then that means your server doesn't have a connection to the internet. Maybe you need to look into the sysconfig about setting a proxy or just download the package directly from our FTP server. Here you'll see our FTP server, ftp.otrs.org, and the actual current package is the support 1.0.91. So once you've got to this point and you've downloaded the package, you can click here to browse for the package that you want. For example, the support OPM and click install. Alternatively, if you have the online repository available, the better way is to just click update your screen will refresh and then you'll have a list of all packages that are available in the online repository. So we look at the one we want to install, it's called support, verify system settings and give some performance tips. So if we go ahead and click install, we'll get the installation page telling us about the support assessment module will be found at the navigation bar in the fourth column and can be used for system checks for undefined setup errors. So we click continue. Once the thing's installed, it'll appear down here at the local repository and as well here as described in the miscellaneous column under the package manager. When we click on the support assessment tool, as I just did, you'll see a list of checks that are performed by this tool. Any types of errors, as you see here, will be noted in the comment and the check will show, or the state of the check will show failed. If you see anything that you're not sure of here, or if you can't fix it yourself, or if you're a paying customer and we have requested a support uh, package from you, then please go ahead and click on Start under Support. There's a little confidential information uh, screen here that comes up with data protection. Just go ahead and accept the license. The email address and the salutation and the name are not changeable. The email address can be centrally configured in the sysconfig. And if you're a new customer, please go ahead and send us some information about your company. So your company, your street, your zip, your city, your phone. And if you have a Bugzilla report referring to this incident, uh, then you can go ahead and put your Bugzilla ID here. As I said, if you're a non-paying customer and you would like to have uh, information about our enterprise support and subscription, uh, then go ahead and leave this check mark in. When you don't want to be informed about these offers because you already have a support contract or you have seen the support contracts and you're still deciding on one, then you can go ahead and remove this check mark. Then just click send. Then it's just a matter of waiting until above this black bar, admin support info, uh, until you see the notification that it was sent on OTRS. Then you can go ahead on about your day and we'll contact you as soon as we have more information about your situation. If you're interested in seeing what we have packaged and sent out to our servers, then go ahead and click download. Then we take the support package that was created and open it. Navigate into the file to see what was actually packed and as you'll see it's a couple of different things that have been packed up here. The most important and the most interesting for us is the archive log which is a complete copy of the installation without any data. Even uh, if you're having concerns about your private information that will be found or can be found in the config PM, for example. Let me go ahead and open that up for you and show you what I was talking about, about the confidential information. Normally you would see the password for the database user here and this type of information has been X'd out by our by our um, privacy tool when creating the file. Okay, I hope this has been informative and uh, empowers you to send us a couple support packages and maybe even sign up for a commercial support or a subscription in order to help your company get the most use out of OTRS. Thank you and have a great day.